Good morning, everyone. This is our campsite. It uh, looks a lot brighter on video than it is out. Sun's not out yet, but uh, the moon is. And uh, we're going from Elk Creek Trailhead to Alcala, Alkali Trailhead, which is about 11 and a half miles. 2,100 feet of elevation gain and 3,800 feet of elevation loss. I think it's going to be a hot one. It is currently, what time is it? 5.27. We want to be on the road by 5.45. About half, half an hour in. Just over a mile, uh, we're, we're climbing here. For the first three miles, it's a gentle climb to the high point for the day. And then downhill, majority of the day, and then there's a section that's uh, a little up at the end. So we'll, uh, we'll check in later. Another beautiful area of the trail. Got some, uh, Field right there, and the trail skirts around it. But uh, as you can tell, it's gorgeous. And that's uh, where the trail came down, right by that rock. We were to the uh, left of it, so uh, we, we scooted over that little knoll and came down this trail. So been pleasant so far. Uh, do have to say, last night was not enjoyable. Heat in the tent, we probably got down to the high 70s. Uh, we did not have to use a sleeping bag. <laughs> it was hot. Famous last words, beautiful wildflowers up here, purple asters, and that's all right. <laughs> old logging road and we're a uh, nice single track been pretty level I think we're coming into a area where we can see the South Dakota Plains out there out there we did get a glimpse earlier back of Bear Butte the temperatures thank God have stayed relatively not hot. But uh, this is the, the view that we have. It is starting to heat up though. When you're here, don't let Poet follow you. It's a dog, a local dog, that the owners 
have a gate right a half mile back, not even, I'm 100 feet back. And they have a place to chain up the dog if it follows you and ring the bell and they'll come out and get the dog. Kind of cool. Teresa just saw about seven turkeys crossing. They probably took off up there. So, I don't see them, but it is gorgeous up here. Coming up on beautiful I-90. We're gonna be walking underneath the, uh, the highway and then heading to the uh, Okay, alkaline horse camp. There's water there, shade, campsites for six bucks a night. What a bargain. Yeah, looks like we're coming to, I see the light, I see the light, I can see the light. All right, much cooler down here than out there. Doesn't smell as fresh, but it's cooler. Here we are, just left. Alkali Creek campground, horse campground. And as we round the corner, you can see our final destination. Let me focus in because of the haze. It is the Bear Butte. And just up past those uh, evergreen trees is the Butte. We'll be uh, summoning that probably tomorrow because we're doing some extra money. Bear Butte. Pretty awesome view of it. We'll give you the history after we go to the uh, visitor center. But it sounds like, I don't know if it was Crazy Horse and Geon Adronimo had a big meeting about the whites, people, was, white settlers coming to yeah. uh, out west. Event. And it was where they uh, met. So we'll, we'll find out more and provide you the information. Sturgis and I-90 
got the birds flying around. That's a, another turkey vulture. And then I don't know if we can see it, but over here is uh, Bear Butte. On this ridge, the sun's going to set over across the west to the uh, Black Hills. There's farmlands, we can hear cows way off in the valley, and then in this direction is Bear Butte. We can just see the outline, but you can't pick it up in the camera. Beautiful little place, nice little breeze. Hopefully, that'll keep us cool.